Moving on, we have news courtesy of High Pace regarding Jound have decided to tease another New Balance 990 that they're going to put out. Um, at this point, I will say many times, actually, I feel like all New Balance colorways kind of blend into each other. I feel like we've seen a variation of this somehow in some place over the years. Maybe the exact color placement isn't the same, but we've definitely seen something similar to this over the years. But still, regardless of the colors being the same, regardless of them absolutely pumping out the, sh the pairs and not really letting us breathe, I actually don't mind these. I have to be honest. I actually really legitimately do not mind these. They're a sort of, uh, what would you call it? Like a shades of brown for the most part. I would say brown overall, but I think some for some reason this little section here on the mudguard, which is, looks like it might be suede, which is brilliant, or nubuck, is kind of giving like wine or something. Not even wine, like a pinky type colorway, like a peach or a plum. But I do like the entirety of the combination of the colors, personally. It looks like they've added some thicker type laces also in these. They look a bit thicker, they look a bit longer also. I'm not sure what the deal is with this, because these shoes already look kind of tight, you know, in terms of lace job. You know how these brands are, they don't bother at all to kind of relace their flipping shoes and make them presentable. But they already look like they're quite tight already, as is and you know the laces are super super long so maybe that's a sneak ahead in just justin saunders the guy who rounds jound where he kind of enjoys having the laces long so he can tie them and make some really big bold loops that look good on an sll camera maybe that's the case but either way i'm a big fan of these and i am eagerly anticipating them dropping you know you can't go wrong with that little jound hit on the insole there you really really can't go wrong so when they do end up coming out i'm a big fan of them and i'm going to try to cop but as per usual it probably won't happen um it says here the studio is building on its coveted collaboration model reuniting to drop another sleek 9904 for version 3 um iterating iteration following its olive and brown pack um, offering of early this year in 2021 john and new bands also teamed up for a popular release of the black and navy expanding its 993 it's 990, sorry, version 3 repertoire. The Canadian label took to Instagram to tease a new colorway arriving before the end of the year, this time taken back to a simple brown hue. The offering sees John, the new balance dress in a mix of colors and olives. Take a look below. But yeah, I already said it. I gave my opinion. I think they absolutely look like fire. I'd wear them in an absolute instant and they are very wearable. And I actually wonder going forward, I wonder if there's ever a scenario where teddy santis is doing a pretty decent job at alias at them sorry alias at new balance at the moment if he leaves or you know whatever else happens you know i wonder if they would offer the job to justin saunders i wonder if he's actually take it and put his own brand or his own sort of consultancy stuff with jan or whatever else he does on hold so that he could work for new bands because i think he'd be a great hire there so would flipping ronnie fake even though he's kind of getting on my nerves lately but i feel like he'd be a good option there also but yeah Jound shoes coming soon before the end of the year they say let's wait and see let's wait and see